General Electric Company announced on Friday that it is selling most of its GE Capital real estate assets to Blackstone and Wells Fargo for $23 billion. The move comes as GE exits its banking business and embraces its industrial core. GE CEO Jeff Immel announced that the company will sell most of its GE Capital assets by 2018. He noted that by that time, GE's industrial businesses will generate at least 90% of the company's operating earnings, up from 58% last year. Connecticut-based General Electric is active in the consumer appliance sector, providing microwaves, refrigerators, cooktops, and other appliances to retailers. It also has an aviation arm, as well as a capital arm, which includes commercial lending and leasing, retail financing, and real estate financing. GE is also active in other areas, including medical devices and energy equipment. Friday's transaction includes real estate and loans in the United States, Europe, Mexico, and Australia. Blackstone announced today that the portfolio it will acquire is comprised of commercial mortgage loans and a diverse set of commercial properties in target and core markets. The initial closings on these transactions are expected to take place in the second and third quarter of this year. Under the plan, the GE Capital businesses that will remain with the company will account for $90 billion in ending net investments, with $40 billion of that in the United States. The deal's Ronald Oral will have more on this situation. In New York, I'm Laura Cooper for The Deal.